These are the Corsair XH303i and 305i RGB Pro Hydrox custom water cooling kits. Essentially, these are the next steps above AIOs in the water cooling game, and in each box is pretty much everything you'll need. But okay, come on, Greg, well, what's really the point of all this? Why can't I just slap an AIO in my rig and call it a day? Well, I'm glad you asked. So the additional cooling headroom custom loops like these allow can make for quieter, cooler systems. They're actually the highest performing feasible approaches to PC cooling. And it doesn't hurt that these kits look pretty darn cool. Now I'll be upfront with you, it won't be the easiest thing in the world to do. Custom water cooling is no small feat. However, I think that the most difficult part of this process is actually sourcing the hardware, making sure that you pick things that are compatible with each other. And also in the middle of building, you don't want to find out that you forgot to order something. And that's where these Hydrex kits come into play. They're convenient fully kitted bundles of custom cooling hardware curated specifically for optimal CPU performance. And before we get to the unboxing, I do want to talk briefly about what to expect inside, and Corsair conveniently includes these lovely pictures so that there are no surprises. And again, when we unbox these things, we'll get into more detail. Just want to, again, give you the highlights. First off, you're going to get a CPU block. You're going to get a pump res combo. You're going to get a 360 mode radiator. You're going to get three fans. You're going to get an RGB and fan controller. You're going to get some 90 degree fittings. You're going to get some standard G quarter fittings. You're going to get some acrylic you're going to get some clear coolant and you're going to get a sweet bend kit. Like I said, folks, it's literally everything you're going to need. These kits from Corsair take the guesswork out of custom water cooling and compatibility is pretty straightforward. If you're wondering, 1150X all the way to the latest LGA 1700 from Intel are supported along with AMD's popular AM4 socket. So for virtually any modern build, you should be good to go. And as for the included 360mm radiator, just make sure your case supports one. Corsair recommends its 4000 series cases for the XH303 kit and the 5000 or 7000 series cases to accommodate the larger pump in the XH305. Oh, and just one more thing to mention before we get to unboxing, these kits are actually designed to save you money. Not only headache, but yes, money. Corsair says that if you went out and bought these components individually from their store, you might end up paying 15 to 20% more than what this kit would cost. So again, if you're going all in with CPU cooling and you want to take it custom, this is the way to go. Now let's have a look in these boxes. To start, you'll find the CPU block we just discussed, the XC7 Pro. It doesn't matter which one you buy, the 303 or the 305 kit, you'll find the same block. This improves upon the original XC7 by a few degrees Celsius thanks to its optimal construction and includes socket interchangeability in case you're wondering. So AMD will look like this and Intel will look like this and the swap is very straightforward. The cold plate in here boasts over 110 individual fins and the new cooling engine aims to increase efficiency overall. Now the pump unit you receive will depend on the kit. The XH303 includes the XD3 which is a compact pump res combo boasting the integrated DDC pump. But for larger builds consider the XH305 and it's included XD5, still a pump res combo, but much larger. The pump type also changes to that of a D5, in case you're wondering. The radiator you'll find in each is the same regardless of the kit, either a black or white XR5. This is a 30 millimeter thick, 360 millimeter rad, copper construction, and of course ideal for CPU cooling. It's pretty straightforward, but we'll talk about the fans you'll pair it with a bit later. As for fittings, eight XTs are included, again, black or white. Now, technically we'll only need six for the other components in these kits, but Corsair adds two extras in the event you decide to also custom cool your graphics card down the line. Custom water blocks or graphics cards aren't included in these kits because there are just so many different cards in the wild, uh, but you can reference Corsair's compatibility checker before buying if you have any questions. Next up is tubing. Corsair includes three whole meters of PMMA, which should be more than enough in the event you mess up a couple of bends. And believe me, it will probably it's, yeah, it'll probably happen, happen to me. And uh, this is your first time around, just kind of expect it. It's part of what makes it so fun in my view though. It's, it's a learning experience. And it, again, will feel so rewarding once you complete it. For those who aren't aware, PMMA is acrylic, which means it's a bit harder to bend, but also more rigid and more glass-like than PETG once it's cooled. You'll find a tool for cutting in the box along with a bend kit for making those sweet 90s. All you'll need is a heat gun to preheat the tubing before bending and sizing. Now we move on to the fans. The XH303i includes three SP Elite fans, which are more performance focused with stator vein tech and integrated RGB. You mount these to your radiator during assembly. Conversely, in the 305, you'll find three QL fans, which are 120s again, uh, but are equipped with top-notch RGB LEDs at both the center and around the exterior of each fan blade. 
all by the way are PWM compatible. And lastly, you'll find Corsair's IQ controller, the Commander Pro, and this thing is friggin' decked. Let me tell you, it'll support RGB and pump control and even monitor temperatures, all of which IQ factors into advanced lighting effects and automatic cooling profiles. And a little fun fact to round things out, you'll find 104 LEDs in the entire XH303i kit. And in the XH305i, that number jumps to 124. That's a lot of lighting done right by Corsair. So hopefully this overview clears up any concerns you might have regarding compatibility and component inclusion. These are again, peace of mind kits for those who don't wanna spend hours picking and choosing water cooling components that let's be honest, may not even work together in the end. Everything you'll need is packed inside the boxes of both the XH303i and 305i. You can find additional info by the way in this video's description. But that's all for now. My name is Greg. Thanks for learning with me.